Hi, I'm Jane. And I'm John. And we're Bucket List Travellers. And in this Malaysian food vlog, we're going to try Mary Brown for the first time. So this morning we went to Batu Caves and we've worked up an appetite. So I'm looking forward to trying Mary Brown. Okay, so they're out of the sliced cheese, but we're going to get the cheese sauce with the Tao burger. Um, they have this special, but they're out of the pink ones, unfortunately. And then we're going to get the Nazi Lamarck as well, so that looks good. food in front of us and I am just salivating. I'm so hungry. Yeah, and it looks amazing. We heard that Mary Brown was one of the best fast food in Malaysia, so we had to check it out ourselves. And I've got to say, just from the look of things, everything looks really, really nice. The chicken looks really freshly cooked. Everything kind of looks pretty similar to the photos, which is pretty good. Yep. Yeah. Is nice that test? And another thing that I really like about Mary Brown is that it's Malaysian um, Malaysian owned fast food restaurant. Yeah, which is really cool. So it's been around for over 40 years. So it was 1981 when it opened up. So, and it's gone global. So it's, it's a real Malaysian success story. Yeah, definitely. And so they've got a few different types of things on their menu and they do have specials from time to time as well. So Nazi Lamak, they've got all sorts of burgers, they've got fried chicken, they've got yeah, different types of combos and they've also got um, like bowl dishes, so like laksa and that sort of thing. So what do we want to start with? Uh, let's go the cheesy fries. Yeah, cheesy wedges. Yeah. So this is 10 pieces for $6.90 and it's just smothered in this creamy sauce and also I think, is it mayonnaise or? Yeah, it's a cheesy sauce and a mayonnaise. Mm. Oh yeah. Oh, that's good. I like that cheesy sauce. It's, yeah, it's a little bit peppery, would you say? Mm. A little touch of spice in there. Mm. It's really nice. I really like that. Mm. Yep. We did another video where we taste tested KFC. And they also had cheesy wedges, so also good. What, what... I think I prefer this one. Yeah, I think I think this one edges out KFC cheesy wedges. So yeah. Yum. Okay. On the cheesy theme, what what is this? That was a cheesy chicken mash. Hmm. So it looks beautiful. So it's got the mash. It's got bits of chicken in there, and then again the cheesy and the mayonnaise kind of sauces. Bit of everything. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Oh yeah. Hmm. I like this too. That mash is really creamy. Yeah. So I'm gonna try some of the mash on my own. Really nice consistency. Yeah. Hmm. The chicken's got a bit of crunch. Yeah. That's quite a innovative take on the mash. And chicken, just chuck it all together. Yeah. Add some cheesy sauce. Don't mind it. Brilliant. This is five ringer. That's probably better value than the cheesy wedges. Mm. Um, and I really like the mash. I would say that the mash is better than the KFC mash as well. So so mm. far, Mary Brown is like it's winning uh, out. It's a winner. So what do you want next? Should we go the Nazi Lamarck? Yep, let's do that. And we got the spicy chicken for the La Nazi Lamarck, so mm. uh, that should be quite interesting to yeah, try. so you can have spicy or original. So the Nazi Lamarck, if you're not familiar with Malaysian food, Nazi Lamarck is the national dish of Malaysia, and it comes with rice, it comes with some sort of meat, so in this case, the fried chicken. And then you've got the sambal, you've got peanuts and what is it sardines cool it comes with the the, the fried anchovies oh, fried anchovies um, and slices of cucumber and this one's got what's it, 
dollars or something like that. That's cool. Yeah. All right. What I love about Nazi Lamac is that the rice is in coconut milk, or like there's a coconut element to the rice. Mm. Yeah, it's really, really yummy. Let's see if that's the case for this <laughs> one. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. yeah, rice is good. Passes the first test. Nice crispiness. Ooh, can you hear that crisp? Mmm. Oh, that's good. Well, while Jay's doing that, I'm going to try some sambal. The chicken definitely has some spice to it. So does the sambal. It kind of oh. goes everywhere. So you probably need to put it. Mm. The sambal is really good. So there's a fair bit of heat there. There's also a little bit of sweetness too. Oh, it's that's really good. And I will say, KFC also had the Nazi Lamac, which we tried. And it didn't come with the fried anchovies. Mm. So this one did. So I think this is passing all the tests so far. And this looks really good. Mm. And I, I, I need I need chicken. Okay. Just put that on there. Oh, these topper dumps have a good bit of crunch to them. I always get worried that you're gonna get like stale kind of ones, but this is pretty fresh. Pretty fresh. Mm. So for the chicken, I like that it was really crunchy on the outside. The meat is tender without being overly juicy. Mm. So it's juicy, but not too juicy. So that's that's really nice. Mm. Yeah, oh, it's all really good. And I'm getting some heat as well after after biting into the chicken. So yeah, there's just the, the right amount of spiciness in that chicken too. Mm. Mm. Thumbs two, up for the Nazi Lamac. Yeah, two thumbs up, that was really good. Mm. Awesome. Okay, just as a palate cleanser, we're going to have some of this. This is, I think this is called Heaven and Earth, was it? Yeah, so I think it's an iced tea, a lemon iced tea or something like that. Mm. Yep, that's very refreshing. Doesn't taste too sweet. Doesn't taste sickly sweet, so. It's a nice balance. Yeah, it's good. I don't think it's fizzy. No, not all. fizzy either. Which is good for me, because I don't like too much fizz. Yeah. So yeah, it's quite nice. Okay, so the Tower Burger. Now this didn't have cheese in it. Usually it does, but they're out of sliced cheese. They were also out of the pink bun for their special, which I was a bit sad about, because that looks really good. Yeah, it still looks pretty good. Shall we lady in the tramp it? Sure, we can lady in the tramp it. Okay. Oh, oh no. Oh dear. <laughs> Take two. Mm -hmm. <laughs> It's a lot more graceful in the movie. Oh, that's oh. good. Mm. I like when the burger is quite saucy. This has got a lot of mayo, yep. a lot of cheese. It's the same cheesy sauce with a few of the other things. Yeah, the burger meat is really nice. Once again, it's nice and juicy without being too juicy. It's really crispy and crunchy on the outside. Oh, really nice. And what's, what's is this a potato thing? patty? I, yeah, I think there's a potato patty. Try that. Is it fish? I don't know. Yeah, you, you have a try because because yeah. there's like the the piece of chicken in there. I'm not sure exactly what that is. So it, it's like it's a processed chicken mm. patty. So you get the unprocessed chicken, the fried chicken, then you get the processed chicken patty. It's nice. I'm not going to complain. So we're not quite sure what. The, that second patty was. If you know, please let us know in the comments. Are we right? Who knows? Okay, so now we've got the original flavour chicken. Oh, we've got one each, so let's try that. Hmm. What do you think? So I do like that it has the nice crunch of the skin and the meat again. Yeah, it's not overly juicy, but it's nice and tender really nice piece of chicken and yeah if you're not after much spice then that's perfect yeah i can't really taste too many like herbs and spices or anything like that but i don't know if i'm just still on fire from like the nuts the and the mac and stuff it's really nice yeah I, I agree completely with the coating there's not really that much herbs and spices to it but it's still really crunchy and still nice mm, um, very tasty very tasty so yeah. Really good. Now, with the fries, they came with one of the meals. 
I don't generally like the thick cut. I'm more, I'm more of a thin cut fry kind of person, but I do like that they've got the crinkle cut. Okay. And it comes with, I'm assuming this is Oh more... no, this is, this is supposed to be the cheesy chicken oh, actually. Whoops. Yeah, we're supposed to smother the chicken with the cheese. Now, I reckon that's going to work even better. Okay, so now we've got the original experience and then we've got the cheesy chicken experience here. So I do like the cheesy sauce. Cheesy sauce is good. Mm. Works really well with the cheesy sauce. Can't complain there. Mm -hmm. Got to say, those fries aren't really doing it for me. No, I, oh, look, I think they're okay. Uh, I'll, you know, maybe not anything too special, but you know, passable for me. I do like the wedges, so the wedges gets my vote. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. So overall, everything's been really good. So what's your favourite? Oh, I like anything burger, so I do like the tower burger. It would have mm. been even better with that slice of cheese, but still it was good. Yeah. Um, oh, no. At the same time, the, the Nazi Lamac was really well put together. Yeah, I was very impressed with the Nazi Lamac yeah. and the cheesy wedges. I really like those. Yeah. Mary Brown gets a big thumbs up from me. Yeah, me too. Yeah, I've got to say this is one of my favourite fast food places now. I'm a definite Mary Brown convert. Very impressed. And they've got so much more on their menu that looks really good as well. So Yeah, yeah it's a shame we didn't have their special buns today but not to worry not to worry and i think today's the last day for pink buns as well but oh well. we hope you enjoyed this malaysia food vlog on taste testing mary brown for the first time if you did give it a like and leave us a comment we've got plenty more malaysian travel vlogs so if you want to follow us on our malaysian adventures make sure you subscribe and hit that notification button we are bucket list travelers see you next time